Do you know what's awesome? The fact that you have been assigned a Google Education account that gives you free access to some very powerful productivity tools and educational resources. Give me your attention for the next five minutes, and in return, I'll give you valuable insight to the largest video sharing website in the world, YouTube. To begin, you'll want to go to www.google.com and click the Sign In button located in the top right-hand corner of the screen. Enter your credentials and click the blue Sign In button. Excellent job! You'll see if you hover your pointer arrow over the circle in the top right-hand corner, it'll tell you if you're logged in. You can see that I, your presenter, Wade Werner, am currently logged in. Now we'll have to click on the Apps Grid. This is also located in the top right hand corner of the screen. You'll see a list of apps. However, we'll need to click on the word more on the bottom of the pop-up grid to see the app we are looking for. YouTube. Click it. YouTube's homepage is entitled What to Watch. It is on this page that you'll find links to videos that are popular right now on the web along with the world's latest sports and music videos. It's also on this What to Watch homepage that you'll find videos that are recommended for you. Keep in mind, as you search and preview YouTube's videos, YouTube keeps in mind what to recommend for you. To access the YouTube menu, look for the menu, uh, the menu button containing three horizontal lines located next to the YouTube logo in the top left hand side of the screen. Click that button now. This action has enabled the YouTube menu to appear. Since we've covered what to watch, we'll click the next item on the list, My Channel. The My Channel section of YouTube allows you to personalize your viewing and broadcasting experience. Archive your videos, create relevant playlists, subscribe to interesting channels, or share your thoughts on other playlists and videos. Advanced users may find the channel tips portion of the My Channel page to view the Creator Studio options. Let's click the YouTube menu again. Select the third item on the list, My Subscriptions. Notice how I'm subscribed to the Google Education channel. There are plenty of channels to choose from that may be relevant to your classroom curriculum. So feel free to look on the right hand side of the screen under recommended channels, click view all or see all and you'll find something that pertains to you. Let's click the YouTube menu again. Select the fourth listed item with a picture of an hourglass. This is your YouTube history page. If you ever need to clear all search history or pause or resume your search history, this is the page you access to do these actions. Click the YouTube menu again. The fifth line item in the menu has a picture of an analog clock and is entitled Watch Later. If you would like to accumulate video playlists that you'd like to watch at a later time, Search for them using the Add Videos button and do a search. We'll type in KGFW and we'll select KGFW 28, add the video to watch it later, and there it is. Let's click the YouTube menu one more time and click My Channel. We covered a lot in this short presentation. Thank you for your time. If you'd like to contact me regarding any of the topics covered in this video, please do not hesitate to do so. My email address is wade.werner at gfwschools.org. Once again, I'm your presenter, Wade Werner. I hope you enjoyed this short presentation on Google's app, YouTube. Have a wonderful day.